Our World Theatre Day celebrations continue and joining me at City Center stage is Central Alberta Theatre's director of One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, uh, Jeremy Robinson. So Jeremy, uh, Cuckoo's Nest kind of correlates with World Theatre Day. Can you tell us a little bit more about the show? Um, well, it uh, takes place in a 1960s um, uh, psychiatric ward. Uh, it's run by this nurse uh, named Nurse Ratchet, who's sort of a uh, runs it sort of like a dictatorship where all the the patients are kind of do what they're told and everything like that. And then a uh, an, a patient uh, who's sort of a wild card named R. P. McMurphy. He he comes into the ward and he kind of ruffles a bunch of feathers while he's here and and he really turns turns the ward upside down with. And he's sort of a free spirit, and, and he gets the other patients to kind of go uh, against Nurse Ratchet uh, a little bit uh, during it. So there's this sort of a clash of of ideals going on between McMurphy and Ratchet. So. so One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest is a story that most people at least recognize by name. As the director, what were the challenges putting on you know such a familiar story? Um, well, uh, I think just because it is, like, it is very well known, like, a lot of people know the movie is very famous and everything, and we didn't really um, concentrate too much on that. Like, uh, we tried to just kind of make it, make it our own, and, um, uh, like, the book, the book, it was originally a book uh, that I read uh, that really inspired me, uh, so I, I mostly focused on, on that narrative, the, the story, that story. And um, and I think we have elements that that are familiar um, for people who do know the story, and and that I think we bring a new perspective to it as well. And as the director, I'm sure you had you know a main goal or a main message that you're trying to deliver. If you could put that into a few words, what do you think that would be? Um, well, I think um, the thing that attracted me to the story was just sort of a. Um, this free will message that 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 the that that McMurphy gives to the patients that um, that it's important to to think for yourselves, not be so uh, I guess familiar with like the establishment that that you might be a part of. That it's important to have a mind of your own, to think for yourself, and to uh, just fight uh, fight against that. The, the people that, that tell you what to do all the time. So. That's great. So going back to your cast, how many people do you have in the play? We have, I believe we have 14 cast members. And how long have you been rehearsing for? We've been rehearsing for about two months now. We and started at the end of January. Oh, that's so. great. So Cuckoo's Nest does open this week. If people want more information, do you have a website they can visit? Uh, they can go to the, the uh, Central Alberta Theatre website. Uh, and then we're, we, we sell tickets at the Black Knight Inn, so you can also go to the Black Knight Inn website, which is blacknightinn.ca. So. Excellent. Well, you can celebrate World Theatre Day right here in Red Deer with One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest.